People who are into content creation and marketing like content marketing and digital marketing know that podcasting is one of the most important new age content formats that are not to be missed out. As somebody who creates or is planning to create podcasts, it's important to make sure that your podcasts are enjoyable to listen to while being highly informative. And there is quite a bit of work involved in making that happen, including having a high quality recording setup and editing and processing multiple audio tracks using audio editing software or digital audio workstation. We've listed down the top three best laptops for podcasting and their key features, plus the things to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all products mentioned in the video are available in the description. You could also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, bluemoo.com. Number 3. Asus TUF FX505 DT Asus makes a gaming laptop that doesn't quite sit well with the gamers. Not because it's a bad laptop, but because of the battery life while extreme gaming. However, for a podcaster, this becomes the best cheap laptop for podcasting. As long as you can overlook the battery life problem, you'll probably only get about 4-5 to five hours from a full charge, not running many applications, you will have a responsive and sleek laptop for your work. The laptop ships with 8GB of RAM and the GTX 1650 GPU. If you want additional RAM, you can buy a single 8GB stick and be happy for years to come. The system also includes the DTS surround sound audio for an intense and immersive sound experience. What makes this guy really stand out though, is that for the price, the parts inside are only one season old, and other brands are charging 150% more than Asus. While you can go for a better option by upgrading to the Ryzen 7 CPU or opting for the GTX 1660 model, there isn't a real need, especially for podcasting, recording, editing, and publishing. The lightweight model will be able to follow you to the coffee shop for that interview, and your next episode can be uploaded before you finish that double latte. Not too shabby for an often overlooked gaming model. Number 2. Acer Aspire E15 Editing your podcast may just be the most tedious aspect of the entire process. That process is made easier with the Acer Aspire E15, the best laptop for podcasting editing. With a full 15.6 inch display and NVIDIA GeForce MX150 video card, you won't have any problems finding the high tones to edit out or where your voice goes flat. With 8GB of RAM and a 256GB SSD hard drive, you have enough power to work all day. However, many find these two specs to be on the low side. Luckily, Acer makes it easy for you to swap. With a single panel at the bottom, you have four screw access to the hard drive and RAM. The laptop itself is durable, rugged, and designed to go all day. With a 15-hour battery life, you won't miss a beat or an interview. A lot will complain that the 15 hours is a standby mode only, but while that is true, you can still get a full 11 hours of video playback time from a single charge, which should be more than enough to edit your next podcast episode. You will need to purchase a microphone and invest in good editing software, but the laptop can push it, no matter the brand or demand. With the Core i5 processor at clock speeds of up to 3.2 GHz, you can edit, record, and publish your podcast without ever experiencing lag. Number 1. Apple MacBook Air one of the most alluring aspects of the Mac family of laptops is that they are already set up for audio and entertainment. This makes it easy for them to be used for podcasting. The Apple MacBook Air is our top pick and the best laptop for podcasting. The 13-inch display isn't as large as some of the others on this list, but it packs a punch with Apple's True Tone and Touch Bar interactions as well as the bright and vivid display. You can also opt to upgrade the SSD to the 256GB capacity, which is recommended. Other than that, you won't need to touch much. You can open the laptop, turn it on, install GarageBand, and start recording instantly. Also, because it is a Mac, you can record using your iPhone and transfer the files seamlessly. 
What's even better is if you don't want to buy an external microphone right away, the Air comes with a 3 microphone array to pick up all of the sounds with better clarity. The stereo sound isn't surround though, but it does have a wide angle output for clearer music and voice. If you're looking for more power, a bigger display, or better input and output for video editing as well as audio, the Apple MacBook Pro is the next step up and well worth checking out. It doubles all of the specs without taking any hits in the negative column. Did this video help you find what you were looking for? If so, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Have a good day.